Hello friends, in this video I am going to give you a quick demo on install and configure Jenkins. Jenkins is an open source uh, Java based automation server that offers an easy way to set up continuous integration and continuous delivery pipeline. Okay. I am quickly going to the demo now. First of all, Jenkins to run Jenkins we need uh, Java. So I install Java. This is my VM running CentOS 7. Okay, first of all, I'm going to install Java OpenJDK. Okay, open JDK installation is completed. Now I'm going to configure Jenkins repository. Here, I execute this command. I'm downloading this repo file to edcm.repos.jenkins.repo. Okay, now let's check the repo list. We have a Jenkins repository here. Now I'm going to install Jenkins. Yes. Okay, Jenkins installation is completed. Now I'm going to start Jenkins. Jenkins okay let's enable Jenkins then checking the status now okay my Jenkins is active and running now let's check some logs of Jenkins okay it's in the background the service is started and Jenkins is uh, starting now it will take some time okay here Jenkins is fully up and running okay now let's let's check our Jenkins URL using this this is my IP with which is running by default on 8080 okay let me check my IP this is my IP and I'm going to in browser and port is 8080 yeah my Jenkins is running now okay let's uh, we need an initial password uh, user account is admin to know the initial password, we can check the file. This file, this file is created when installing Jenkins. This is my initial password. Okay. Let me check with this password. Okay, I'm inside my Jenkins. Okay. Let's do a few things here i'm not going to deep here i'll be uploading more videos on how to work on jenkins let's check what are the things here let's see there are six red maybe we can just click correct to fix uh, this is actually uh, plugins it's updating a few plugins few plugins and uh, the installations it's it's actually doing some upgrade i'm selecting all and download now and install afterwards so here what it what is this currently doing is it's installing it's uh, uh, upgrading a few packages few plugins in the Jenkins okay let's do this it's uh, it will take a few minutes 
it's uh, it's installing one by one okay now let's uh, quickly go through the other things the important things that uh, Jenkins has which is the configure system here we do all the global settings global configurations of Jenkins will be here like uh, if you click this here we have uh, Maven global land options Jenkins URL email Jenkins shells executable this is the email configuration and you may configure SMTP SM, SMTP server here okay and custom emails everything here I'm not going deep here I'll be uploading more videos on this especially for working inside Jenkins here we have a global security configuration where we configure the security who can access what project who can work or who, who can do admin role who can do who can build job who can uh, create job who can uh, configure pipeline etc all these things will be coming here here credentials all the security you know, all the keys and uh, username password everything will be coming here this will enable Jenkins to communicate to the its hosts okay and here the global tools configuration here we configure all the tools we use inside Jenkins and one more this is one more important thing which is uh, manage plugins here we manage all the plugins we have a number of plugins available for Jenkins you can download and use what are the plugins that you need for your purpose I'll be doing some kind of uh, uh, I'll be using some plugins in my few in, in my upcoming videos to uh, uh, to do stuff with Jenkins here we have system information system logs load statistics here you can see load statistics here Jenkins CLI that's a command line but normally we don't use that script console manage notes manage notes here we can add a, a Joe, uh, notes here uh, to run jobs on the we can run jobs on multiple nodes from this Jenkins and uh, here we manage users users and groups we can connect to AD in the AD also and we can manage users okay guys that's all we have uh, in this uh, tutorial thanks for watching please like this video and click, click the subscribe button I'll be uploading more videos on working inside Jenkins uh, to run uh, jobs and all. Okay, thank you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.